Well, you're looking at the metal and wood channel, which we got some chainsaws from China on here. You know what this is? It looks like a 382. 382. Uh, this, I guess you could say, is one of my personal collections. It's a, I guess you could say it's a kit saw put together. I don't know who has them. I kind of got them all by accident. I got a handful of them. They're not for sale. They're my own personal saws. But that starter assay is so smooth on there. That thing's smooth. So whatever they did to that, they got it right. Yeah. I heard the clutch is the same as a 360. Sure looks like it. It does it? It sure does. Man. It looks just like what factory steel looks like. Yeah. They're, nice. Got the slant cylinder coupe on it. They're making, uh, oh, it does have a slant cylinder. Yep. See that? Oh, wow. That's very distinctive with the steels and the new Husqvarna's. Oh, really? Yep. Got the slant cylinder on it. That's cool. Like the OAV 31s and 32s. Cool. It's a nice one. Yeah. First I've ever seen aftermarket. Yeah, I uh, I've run one for a while. I never I never tuned it up properly when I started running it, so I need I need to get it out again and run it run it again and run it better. See what this muffler looks like. Got those ports on the side. No, no ports in front. That's interesting. All right. Well, that's. Oh, it's got a good serial number on there. Look at that. Yeah, serial number. Serial number. Let's see. Look at that. That's how you can identify your chainsaws when they get stolen from you, especially when somebody does. A review and captures them in the film. Like, subscribe, share, thumbs up. Take care.